has been mentioning. We did talk about it at the top of our coverage. Robbie Manalang, Ryan Costello, Kenny Roca Curva against the Marcelina Twins and Mr. Judel Fuentes. And right off the bat, Kenny Roca Curva to the delight. Be that coach Arnold Contorno will be the interim head coach just for tonight's game. Maybe we can find out later on from Andrea why Coach Louis was not able to make it. But Judel Fuentes does so in his first shot of the game. Asambuanga. Maestre, extra pass to Robbie Manalang. He can hit that. And he definitely does so right there. Oh, oh. Lakapag practice pato sa bataan, Javi. A steal here for Zabanga. What a pass there. <laughs> Word block already. Nandes made very sure of that. As you already mentioned during our pre game, pre game discussion, that they were showing some signs of that against Ilo Ilo. But today, with more time to practice, Coach Boyet. Alam mo yung 20 chance points for. Uh, does it family's brand sardines? This three point shot by Kenny Roger of Curva is brought to you by Extreme One Stop Shop Appliances. Member of the San Sebastian Tags, while it's the Marcelina Twins played for the Lyceum Pirates. No, oh. JC turns the corner, left hand finish. That's too easy for the MVP. Curva, the designated inbounder, lobs it. Ballesteros catches but loses. To JC Marcelino. Oh, oh. Ang hirap no, no, especially pag alam mo malapit. Oh, okay. oh, oh, kasi hindi na hindi alam mo yon. Hindi rin madali kasi na lakat lakapak lakapalo na sa pangalan mo lagi yung uh... the jumper of Jodel Fuentes a stop for Zamboanga. Chance to extend this lead. JB Marcelino drives right and finishes the deuce. The MBBL Trophy. Oh, oh and uh, alam mo yon na uh, since college palang da. Kahit napakaganda ng performance nila, they even had an, an 18-0 uh, run in the elimination. Pero ayun pa yung kulang sa kanilang dalawa eh. And uh, right now, especially playing... Time failed to tap into a teammate. Caballero, shot clock at 8. Oo, uh, and uh, with this group talaga si Choi dapat ang dapat uh, makatira sa 3-pointer plus this guy. John Mahari, coach, you were talking about how... Down low. Yung, uh, kasi yung energy, nandun eh, uh, nabibigay siya ng 3-4 minutes playing time, pero impact eh. At here in the first quarter, after the scramble for the loose ball, Manalang able to go inside, get the contact, plus the basket, a chance for one more at the line for Robbie Manalang. Oo, hindi na talaga makakailag si Mahari had the 3 earlier. So Ignacio gets it back, and this time he's the one who, could, who dials it from the outside. Oh, oh I don't know, given a chance, and especially Rekli, just have to take advantage of that. Score is tied at 17. Josa Nimes trying to make something happen. Nimes against Tansico. That is a floater off the glass for Josa Nimes. Oh, oh. Pareho sila ng style ng play ni Tansico, eh. Tama ka, Chad. Gabayni was blocked by Alvin Baichong, and it seems... Ay, lagi ang tinitignan ko. And usually teams that ends up in the top 5 or top 10, yung talagang mga, ayun, mga defensive-oriented players that are well-rounded talaga. And your players are very lucky, Coach, to be also mentored by one of the best defensive players of all time in Coach Glenn Kapak. Point guard. Pwede kaya mag-facilitate. But Jeff Lorenzo trying to prove to everybody that he too can be called a legit point guard. Well, as Tonton Garalta, who also was drafted last Sunday. Congratulations to you. Chavenya able to score on the elbow jumper. 3 to 21. Namang dito ang Pasig City. Soy Ignacio off of the handoff. He was able to hit the three earlier. Yeah, good line there. And you know he has that. Chabenya trying to break down Tosi Tansinko. Chabenya, that's a difficult shot, but no problem for Al Chabenya. Back your outer leg, your step side, your outer leg mo ang maglalateral slide. Eh. Pero ngayon, upisahan mo na ng inner leg mo eh. Tapos outer leg. Which is something that a lot of players have really been in the vertical as well. Oh, oh wala pang legs eh. Oh. Yeah, the things that he was used to doing. But he was still in good shape. Oh, oh and, 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 and this guy is anytime. 
ready anytime he will go at it with everything that he's got absorbing the contact and finishing to the left hand how many times have we seen that oh ayun na ayun na yung nakikita natin ngayon just like that joseph gabayni swatting that shot on do in a turn naman kung paano niya ipagkabitin itong uh, lineup na binuot sure. Arcelino failing to hit from downtown. Peralta is ahead of the back. Anton Peralta will finish. Yeah, because Ryan can just score. He can do everything actually. Even down to rebounding the basketball. Costello has proven that this year. Oh, punong puno dito sa likod natin. Christian Bolaño has also seen action for the first time. But Ryan Costello, that is not the first time we're seeing him hit a three-point shot. For his boys, kung gaano nakalayo ang kanilang team. Harry and Coach Louie. Thank you so much, Andrea. Beautiful report. And so far, we've really been seeing a great head-to-head -head battle between these two squads. Walang team ang makaalago so far. Runs hard is okay. Using that uh, Princeton offense na, uh, alam mo yun, marami talagang movement muna before getting to your point of attack. Yan ni Ryan. Eh. Ryan gets it to Cannon as the rock back. Costello, he makes it look so... Banga will try to break the deadlock. Good pass. Tato's on the roll. Short stab. That's good for us. Setups like that to Adi Santos. Well, it's now different for Zamboanga as everybody is trying to share the wealth, especially JC Marcelino. A spin. Extra pass, Costello from way out, almost but not quite, but look who's there. Look. For those, those offensive rebounds. Look at that. It seems everybody was waiting for everybody else to grab the rebound for Zamboanga. And they did not notice Kenny Rocacurva flying out of means. JV sets up, Caralipio blocked by Maestre. Rocacurva ahead to Costello, not enough time. And Also trying to get better seeding sa Norte kung saan magulo pa sa taas. Oh, oh. JV, the lob, Adi Santos, that's an, an easy two points for the big man. You know, yung sets kasi, yung family, yung sets, man. Costello setting it up here. Manalang pops out. Balesteros offers the screen. Robbie pulls up for three. That's good. Oh, oh and don't give him that space. This three-point shot of Robbie Nalang is brought to you by Extreme One-Stop Shop Appliances. Coach Louie was already mentioning the balance in terms of pick na mas parami pa dito uh -oh. sa ating second half. At ang score natin ngayon, tied at 46. <laughs> <laughs> Roca Curva off the bounce. Kasi ang ganda ng uh, action on both strong side and weak side. Gabayni, oh, Balesteros, watch live. I'm sure everybody's also enjoying back home. Manalang, able to get to the passing. JB to Adi Santos, hesitates, takes it, makes it. It's an 11 lead changes. This was the basket by Adi Santos, elbow jumper. We're seeing, goes inside, side what step. Short saves it to Robbie Manala, who saves it to Balisteros. Chant to the other side. Costello was trying to draw a foul. But that not realized. Na lang eh. Peralta from the outside. Yes, sir! Passing now up by five points. Offense, especially already with great open court players in the Marcelina Twins as you look at that three-point shot by Tonton Peralta. That's the second of the game. Uh -oh, and That's a 6'7", six, 6'8 six, guy with very long arms. Ballesteros tries one the outside. <laughs> oh my goodness! What is happening? Yeah, playing. Kailangan niya pa rito. 
come fourth quarter. One minute and 35 remaining here in the third quarter. Sean Mahari knocks down a much needed basket there to stop the drought for Zamboanga. Siri, na meron itong uh, Families Brand Sardines right now with this kind of lineup. Hahanapin na lang nila kung kanino yung may mismatch. Tapos from the free throw line, Sap goes back to Zamboanga. Caralipio attacks to the Good left. Pass. Mahari inside for two. Christian Bolaño attacks by Chong. Almost a walk. Chan, top of the circle that's three. Good. That's good. Tyro Chan, X3 to 56. Alam mo yun, ang unang, ang un, pinapag-usapan natin. Three throws. Uh -oh, and, uh, and, and this is the family's brand sardines right now. Uh, if you notice, if you look at yung combination minutes. The JC or JV, sa sahig. Uh Oo. -oh. Fourth quarter now underway between Zamboanga and Pasig. This is Hamisandria and Disho. A zone here for Pasig. Marcelino right away attacks the seams of the defense and scores. Yeah, he makes it look really good. Kung coach, na pag usapan natin to in one of our Papano coverages. Kaya, uh -oh. Papano kaya kung meron ng push at Javi during your time? <laughs> <laughs> Edi sana, di na, wala pa ako dito ngayon. <laughs> JC Marcelino now. Mahari. Does it settle for the three? The bounce pass, Caralipio. This is where... Kaya lang, nagbinti sulit siya. Mula sa tres. But he gets the offensive rebound. JV Marcelino, bounce Good pass. Back. John Mahari, the extra feed. Intercepted by Grimaldo. JC, basket and one for the reigning MVP. Yeah, this epic move of the game in partnership with OG Ben. Together we win. JC Marcelino, you know he's going left. And yet, he still finds a way to get it into the basket. This time, we turn you over to Ms. Andrea Indizio. Despite all the recognitions, Best Player of the Game awards for JC Marcelino, never daw siyang nakontento. He really has this growth mindset kung saan in every good thing na meron siya. Has been eluding JC Marcelino and even JV throughout their entire career. So no matter how hard they've been playing, no matter how much success halfway through this fourth quarter. JV... Jump pass, Tosi Tansinko, 4-3. Yes, sir! JV finds his twin, JC Marcelino. Two plus one special on the way. Oh, that's chemistry, Javi. Coach Louis, chemistry from the womb. Di na kailangan magtinginan. Di niya makailangan malaman kung nasan siya sa sarig. Basta alam niya kung saan dadalhin yung bola. And that back cut. Okay, right now, 73 to 71. Well, that should be 74, am I right? No, it's not right. Before the All-Star break, talagang happy ang mga fans natin kasi dalawang motor na pamigay. Aliyub intended for Balesteros. This could be a slam, but no, but still. Oh. That breaks the tie. Fuentes, though, gets the three-pointer. Fresh off the bench, but proving Fuentes with a spear sat out a big stretch of the third and fourth quarters. Jodel tries to get the step on Tyro Chan. Jodel Fuentes with a finish. 81 77. Gentlemen, crucial baskets in the end game for Jodel Fuentes, last year's mythical five selection, now with the Zabuanga family's brand sardines. Doing the things that he does best. And Costello gets the handoff. Tancinco shows. Balesteros definitely was clipped on the arm. But see here if Balesteros will be able to capitalize. First one is short. A lot of cheers and a lot of boos coming from the Zamboanga crowd here in the Inares Arena. Balesteros able to split his charities. It's a screen from Maestre. Manalam, step back. This is going to be big. Costello for three! The patience. Alam naman natin, nandiyan pa rin ito si Ryan Costello. All those three things, plus the big basket. Ryan Costello, 81 apiece, 38.44 seconds remaining here in this game. Coach Buddy... 
Pancinko doesn't settle for the three, puts the ball on the deck. Ballesteros. Uh oh. Of Tosi Tancinko. There you go. Even better angle. Yeah, uh, and uh, Coach Boy still need, uh, needs to. Uh... Yes, he was given a warning in the first half. Tancinko able to drain the second. Uh oh. So 28.1 seconds left in the game. But deep corner. Costello forward to Robbie Manalang. Manalang for three. Rattles it home, Robbie Manalang, three-pointer. Well, let's see. Fuentes leaves it, Gabaini inside, Zamboanga back in the driver's seat. Yeah, minutes uh, with this kind of pace. Alam natin marami pa pwedeng mangyari. At and, totoo nga. At totoo nga nangyari. <laughs> wow. Great composure here. Oo, imagine, alam mo yun. Sobrang nipi, sobrang konti lang pero muntik pwede pang mafoul ni Jan Mahari si uh, Robi Manalang take on that three pointer eh. Pero jo Mahari Grimaldo Adi Santos sorry that's Tosi Tatsiko Grimaldo intercepts. Yeah. You know what? Yeah, Tyron Chan eh, umislip si uh, Ryan Costello. It's an open even Robbie Manalang was open from the corner. Yeah, but uh, still a lot of time. Uh, 7.5 seconds left. Tancinko missed the first, missed Miss the both. second. Manalang goes out of the screen. Ballesteros sets one. Ballesteros gets it. Costello, extra pass. Ballesteros with the score. And that is the game. Oh my goodness. Ryan basket, look at that, setting the screen. Uh oh. Receiving the pass. Slip. Oh my goodness. And on the coverage, got it to Jason Ballesteros, who was wide open. Uh oh. Open. Uh oh, as expected, we know that this game will go down the wire. And, uh, you know, yung breaks, na, yung break, breaks of the game that happened. Alam mo yun, Tansingo missing uh, two free throws, tapos no, nagkaroon ng out of bounds, nagkaroon ng review thing, and this, ito, ito yung naging resulta. Our referees are still reviewing if there should be still some time left on the clock. Currently, may point two seconds. At some watch mark dyan eh, di ba na, we, that we cannot extend. Pero, sports, yeah. Including the head coach, Boyd Fernandez, for improper bench decorum. And look at the face of Coach Boyet. Coach Boyet knows. Another technical will result in two free throws. All right, so there you have it. The technical foul given to Coach Boyet Fernandez. No shooter this season. This is what happened. This was the shot by Jason Ballestero, set up by Ryan Costello. There you see Coach Boyd Fernandez already crossing over to the other side to try and congratulate Coach Arnold Cotono because he thought wala nang oras oh, na the game is over. Will be shot by Jodel Fuentes. Fuentes ties it up right here, uh -oh. 85 all. So let's see. Cinco will now inbound. Fuentes for the win. All we right. are going into overtime, folks. What a turn of events here at the tail end of the fourth quarter. Like Filipinas Basketball League overtime between the Zabuaga Families Brand Sardines and the Basic City MCW Sports Sound by King Caralipio. Uh, uh, and uh, you know, during extra period, kung sino yung team that mag mag magpupunta doon sa mag mas mas magtitiwala at time they set up Tyrone Chan for the three point shot 88 to 85 Quente sneaking through the defense gets the roll on the shot to be able to hit crucial shots para sa kanilang kabunan Costello catch set fire splash yeah two three pointers already for overtime oh uh -huh. at mahaba pa to Yung last two minutes nga natin kanina, inabot pa tayo ng 30 minutes. <laughs> Tama ka dyan, coach. 91 to 87, two possession ball game. Fuentes, that's gonna be a foul. 
way to cap off our MBBL Tuesday here at the United Sports Arena. Check on yung mga game schedules natin because uh, right now, yung mga, yung as expect, expected mo yung mga ganitong klaseng games, yung labanan ng mga... Thanks all of them. Trying to prepare and get sharp for the postseason that is coming very, very soon. Oh, uh, and I, I like what you said. Uh, it's, again, being sharp, being prepared, day of game, at iba yung series games. Oh, this is definitely playoff atmosphere basketball that we are witnessing. In all scorers, Roca Corva jumps a pass. Chan, oh, yeah, that's, that's over that and back. A miscommunication between Ryan Costello and Tyro Chan. The turnovers that you really cannot afford because hindi mo man lang nabigyan yung sarili nyo ng chance ng mag-attempt. JC Marcelino picks up his dribble, passes Caralipio, another lefty here. That's good for King Caralipio, once again delivering when it matters the most. Marcelino goes right, yeah. blocked by Jason Ballesteros. Despite all of the things that you just said, I'm sure they still want to come away with a victory here today. They did everything to be able to try and get it in regulation. Unfortunately, some things didn't go their way. Ngayon nanganganib ang panalo muli para dito sa Pasig. I hear Grimaldo spot minutes in this game, but look at this crucial pass to JC Marcelino for the easy score inside. Didn't have to put the ball on the floor, just got the pass, and then finished it inside. JC Marcelino wants up here. Yeah, he, he's one, one out of one. Costello gets the ball. Against Caralipio, Ryan makes space, lobs it. Ballesteros, hard foul given up by JC Marcelino. That could have been a slam. Oh, oh. You have to do everything in your power to prevent easy two points, and that exactly what was supposed to happen. But kita mo naman, he had a good chance for a clean block. Oh, oh and uh, you know, it, it's good also na These two to trap. Also interesting if mimintis niya ba yung pangalawa, and then oh, oh. will they try to get for the offensive rebound? But for that to happen, kailangan niya may shoot yung una, which he did. Yeah, maybe force that eight-second violation first. Mahari gets the inbound. Caralipio gets it to Fuentes. They get it across, talking about Zamboanga, and Peralta will finally give up the foul. 10% free throw shooter this year. Fuentes gets the roll on the first away from victory number 19 yeah. Chavena looks at the clock Lorenzo gives it up Costello being challenged here by Mahari Costello goes inside Costello will score is that gonna count? Ryan was looking at the clock and Mahari was all oh, over oh, him I foul pa eh. yeah you know yeah it was all still in his hands what a ball game, ladies and gentlemen. Definitely, that goes down as one of the best games this season. Basic, obviously, not happy with the way things turned out.